You know, seriously, what I do when life is overwhelming for me is I go shoot hoops. Yeah, that's, that's a good thing. I mean, I feel like I can... I don't know if it's just getting my mind off it and just trying to figure out, how. okay, how many free throws can I make in a row? Or, or, or it's just what it is for me, you know what I mean? Right. But you must play ball. Yeah, yeah. You still play ball? I still do. I started... I actually injured my back playing ball like in 2002. Not good. Like on one of those like really crappy pickup games where you, you're playing against some kids and you just shouldn't even be playing because <laughs> right. the competition's terrible. And then you just end up hurting yourself. Um, and I had to have back surgery. And, Are you and serious? It was, yeah, it was tough. So I, I haven't played like a serious pickup game in a while. But now my, you know, my kid's seven now. And um, after school, we go to the playground and uh, shoot around. So I... I started shooting around a lot and I try and get him into it. And, you know, so hopefully I'll be able to, if he gets into it, I'll coach one of his teams as he gets older. Hey, that's cool. That's what, but that's why you write a song like Shooting Hoops, right? Well, Shooting Hoops is a good song for me because um, that was one of uh, the tunes where I really started. I was making this blues, right? And, um, but I was doing blues about things that, uh, you know, that I could know about. And, and I was doing these, like, inner city snapshots of mm -hmm. Philadelphia and Philadelphia is such a big hoops town. There's yeah, all right. these famous inner city courts that I talk about in the song and, um, Seeger park and old pine and star garden and stuff like that. And, uh, and, uh, you know, basketball has always been my favorite sport. So yeah, I was trying to play while well, I was playing high school. I was thinking when I was young, like in junior high that I would be, you know, a college player, but I chose kind of music in yeah. around 10th grade. And luckily, because I don't think I probably would have made <laughs> Division One by any means. You wouldn't have been on Villanova's team this year? I don't think so. 